have BMW i8 laser light in action. So it's LED lights with addition of laser that I assume is measuring the length how, how long you can have full beam you can see it illuminates the sign and uh, you can see it's really strong light straight ahead It looks like it really illuminates as far as you almost can see. It's almost too much illumination on, on reflective signs. So it almost almost blind blinds you. You can see the house there how sharp it lights it up and it steers follow the the curve also so it's really interesting how far the technology of lights have come the last 10 years i remember when exelon was a new thing now that feels ancient compared to this and like you have the kind of blue more bluish tone to the laser because I believe it's some kind of other light spectrum or what you say nanometers something other spectrum or frequency or so now it's not pitch black here but we'll see if it will be a darker part which usually is not a problem to find this time of year in Sweden You can see it almost illuminates the day, uh, the, the road in front of us as a day. And I'm sure, quite sure it works with GPS as well. And it should uh, do anti dazzle uh, on, on oncoming cars. Lines off when it's not necessary, I assume. So here it's not active at all, it seems like. But still illuminates the, the signs. So white. Sometimes it feels like it should steer somewhat more into the corner. But I, I assume it also works takes into consideration animals and such things. Interesting to see that the center is so illuminated, so light. And the reflective size is almost too sharp. Stretch. Whoops, can see? 
Bambi. Good we went under the speed limit there. It's interesting what decides like full beam from not completely full beam. BMW i8 because it will be really blinded. But it should have anti dust, but I have a feeling you will be blinded anyway because it's so strong, this laser light. You can see how far away you can see that sign illuminated. Problem seeing signs. It's, it's interesting to see how wide it lights up. You can see it really up in the trees sides. And I assume it's standard on the i8. It's funny why it cut off there, maybe because of the light from the above the bridge. So that was a little show of BMW's laser light on the BMW i8. Just so let's see how modern BMW's laser lights are on this country road. It's interesting to hear, hear both the whine of like the electric motors and the petrol engine at the same time. the sharpness and you also hear the combustion three cylinder engine in the background it's a BMW i not the BMW M that's the key here the key takeaway you can see if it Shuts down the light. Oh, yeah, looks like it's on the car. When we met the car.
No, it looks like it basically shut them down there. A full beam when driving on an illuminated road. 